port wapi in Portugal why we are in the president seat why we are in law to the president we decide whether you are a Kenya or you are a Tanzania or Uganda or Welcome back to AFAX number one stop to entertainment and trending news. Now, with the recent passing of Rita Waini at an Airbnb in Roisambu and the fingers being pointed at a Nigerian man to have allegedly taken her life, it has not been easy for Nigerians in the country. There have been people who have been advocating that they need to leave Kenya. There has been quite some tension. In fact, the other day I shared with you guys a video of Kwambox from Kiss FM having said that I don't care what you guys are feeling about Nigerians right now but she's vibing with them and this sparked quite an outrage with some people saying she needs to get fired what happened to Shafi needs to happen to her as well and even the Nigerian High Commission two days ago advised all its citizens in Kenya to be vigilant and avoid unnecessary movements they also asked them to remain calm and continue being law abiding but we can also commend Kenyans for not being aggressive there haven't been any incidents of Nigerians being mistreated but one nigerian man took to his social media to say there is nowhere they are going for those who are advocating that nigerians need to be deported his message got kenyans in laughter because he threw also a few swahili words there saying hakuna pahali wanaenda waende wapi he also threw in casually that they just can't be thrown out there when the president the current sitting president that is william ruto his daughter is actually married to a Nigerian. So these are in-laws. They're also stating that they have children here in Kenya. So where do you want these children to go? And I want us to listen to this conversation because it was quite hilarious. But also putting a message out there that they are not going anywhere. Good morning, good afternoon, wherever you are watching this video from. Um, um, I've been following this thing that happened in Nairobi. Um, the post of Nairobi gossip about Nigerian a Nigerian guy suspected to kill a, 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 a lady and traveling with Mozambique passports and read the comment um, of chaos ah, is alarming and some protest is alarming yeah a particular guy a particular Nigeria did some let's say now nah, that, that guy is a Nigeria okay let's put it you should be arrested and persecuted not saying all Nigerians have done, all Nigerians should be deported, this and that. Deporting Nigeria will not solve the problem in your country. We not solve the problem of chaos. That is truth. If you, even if you deport Nigerians, all of them now, they go home. You have you solved your problem. Just because of maybe a, a Nigeria collected your friend that uh, your girlfriend that has a um, uh, big matak or big siam. Send out my, my dog. That doesn't mean that doesn't mean that you should. And this is a threat. It's just it's just coming from the men, not from the women. And this is crazy. It's crazy how a fellow African man we see his own fellow African man and having hatred. If a Nigeria come, if a, a one single Nigeria commit crime, arrest him. I support you for that. But clarifying that you should deport all Nigerians, bro. Man, your hatred is too much, and he's, he's even you are a village champion. Yeah, let me let me say this thing without not. You are a village champion because you have never traveled out of these premises. That's why you are talking about deportation. Do you know what is deportation? Or talking about free visa? Even if even if even if a um, Kenya visa is one million Kenya shilling, but people will still enter here and do their things and go home. Because, because you would not tell me if he's a if he's a bad someone, he will not have money to travel to do. He will have money to travel to travel to do his things as a ritualist. Let's call a spade a spade. Yeah? We have Kenyans in Nigeria. Someone like uh, um, uh, Vera Sidika travel to Nigeria, do her things and come back. Big people. Big Kenyans. They can't come out and say this kind. Of, they can't drop that kind of comment. Because they know they know the impact Nigeria and Nigeria as a country have put in their life. Yeah, if a particular person did something, let's let's arrest that person and persecute that person. Allow this AI to do his work. If that person that person is just suspected to be 
allow this year to do his to do their work and if they find that person guilty good and fine let's stop this hate let's stop this hate yeah fatherly okay those saying deport nigerians deport nigerians we have many seed here we have we have spread the seed all over this country well it, it, it will personal me personal personal me or bush fire fire i i i have spread i have a, i have in i have in kisuma i have in siaya i have in migosi precisely migosi i have in migosi and i have in kakamega i have in lift valley in etoret i have in busia in nairobi i can't even count so will you also deport those your brothers because they are also cares they have the same rights you have as a care will you also deport them even if you deport me have you deported those ones those ones are still me and them <laughs> so you got to accept us accept us you understand? but if a nigeria come if a, a, a single or a two nigeria or any any group of nigeria commits crime just arrest them do what you have to do, do what the law has said you should do to them. But saying you will deport all Nigeria, how many will you deport? Eh? Yeah, wow. This is more than some care and saying deport Nigerians, deport. Deport Wapi, deport Ghani. Why we are in the president seat? Why we are in law to the president? We decide whether you are a Kenya or you are a Tanzania or Uganda or Rwanda. We just, if you talk too much on social media and you say they were um, deport Nigeria, so we, we now we deport you to Uganda or to or, or to or to Rwanda or to Tanzania. You go there and be playing your role there. We are we are in laws and we have come to stay. So there is no going back. If you like, we we'll come out to the street and say the Port Nigeria. We are not going anywhere. CND, CND Mahali, and you heard it from the Nigerian himself, Siendi Mahali Niko Hapa, basically saying, for those who don't speak Swahili, there is nowhere he's going. They are staying right here. And he decided to throw a few Swahili there to emphasize that he means what he says. And like he said, let the few Nigerians who are caught in the wrong side of the law be dealt with, but not all Nigerians should be punished because of one particular person or or a group of individuals anyway that's it you are up to date thanks so much for watching subscribe and hit that notification bell so you will be the first to be notified once you have any new updates i'll catch you on the next one bye bye